Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel, The Blood Samurai. My name is Sam and today we're back playing Hex Guardian. This is a game I'm, I I always look forward to playing. And uh, we're trying to beat my record of 10 days on the desert level. We've unlocked quite a few things. Um, honestly, if we could, can we, can we just like cut this path off right away? Just offer more rewards. Um, I'm gonna go with that. But yeah, there's so many like mistakes that I've made while playing this game, and all of all of the losses I've had are pretty much based on my mistakes. Like, even in the last video, it's like, that was 100% my bad. I could have used a sandstorm, I'm pretty sure, I don't know if I had another ability, I just know I could have used a sandstorm, and I should have. Um, and that would have helped out a lot. I probably would have completed that level if, it, if, I had, if I had done that, but me being stupid, I, uh, I indeed did not do that, and it cost cost me that that round and that really sucks let's just upgrade that ice tower definitely my uh, favorite tower to use I would say um, I'm honestly not sure what to do with this part here. and the water as well is gonna be quite a problem Cause I'm not sure how to like really connect it from this point. I was very close last time to like connecting everything, connecting all the pathways. So, like if you guys haven't checked out that video, I would highly recommend you guys go check it out. Yeah, I was very close to just connecting all the pathways up and and I just just barely couldn't do it. That sucks. Sucks really badly. Ah, uh, this this part sucks. Why can't I put it there? Oh, because it would just lead into. Let's just do that, I guess. Have it connect there. What is this part? Okay. Put this, like, far away over there. Increase the damage. I feel like the best strategy in this game is just to have, like, a few... few like, a couple different towers. And, like, the fewer towers you have, the better. But, like, ice towers are pretty good because they, like... They obviously slow down enemies. So have like some. So have your ice towers slow things down, and then have like archer towers to deal lots of damage. I feel like that's like the best way to go about it, in my opinion. Other people might have a different opinion, but that's my opinion. Come on, just like block up the pathway, please. I'm gonna do that though. I at least know now that it it is all just based on luck. Whether or not the pathway gets blocked up. Cause it can happen. But it's all based on luck, whether or not it does actually happen. Oh my gosh, I'm just getting a bunch of, like, useless paths that just do nothing. And then I'm getting stuff like this that I don't need. But 
something like that there. So yeah, it's like we got that guy there. He'll be good. Yeah, let's do that. What is this? Like, we could have... Oh, so let's just do that. Let's see how it goes. Um, yeah, let's extend the attack range. This does nothing. Let's put that over there. Yeah, like, like groups of enemies are not gonna be a problem ever. That is, that is what I am realizing. Like, groups of enemies, never, ever, 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 ever gonna be a problem. But it's just like. It's just the the once the sometimes really strong enemies, and they're the problem. The enemies that like are, are like these guys that are fast and tanky, and and mainly it's just super incredibly tanky units. They're the problem. They're the units I can't deal with. Oh my gosh, am I getting sick and tired? Things like this. Um guess we can go for that. I don't know. Go with that. Go for an archery range. I guess an archery range could product pro like provide a little bit of extra support maybe enough to take out like these guys but yeah it's like those guys are just the boat okay the boats are our pro everything in this game is just a problem for me right now um everything everything okay we Nine days was the best one. I'm assuming that was on the last thing because I made it pretty far on the last one. Okay, these two should be easy to connect. These two should be easy to connect. So I have high hopes for that. And yeah, like I said, these two should be pretty easy to connect. Um, if we can, like, like, kind of break that part off, then I think we'll be, like, in a really good position. We'll have that part for there. And the reason I'm doing that is for the sake of... Um... Okay, yeah. We no longer need to worry about... Okay, so we can put that like there. Uh, oh, let's let's do that. Okay, so yeah, we only need to ever worry about land units from now on. Um, water units are literally just non-existent. Never need to worry about them ever again. Now, if we can do the same thing, target. Oh, that's actually going to be really good. Now, we don't need to worry about that area anymore. Okay. We're getting very good, very high luck right now. I'm very happy with what's happening. Now we have an oasis. We can just build the oasis right there. Uh, 
Um, I guess we can do that, but... Uh, we're actually in a very good position right now. Like, I am very surprised at how well things are currently going. Not saying that they're going to last, but there is a chance of... There, there's hope. There's hope that we can just bridge the gap and things can just go perfectly without water enemies, like just, we can just be in peace. Like we can't, we we shred through huge groups of enemies. Like huge groups of enemies are are no problem for us. It will just always be the extremely tough, strong enemies that will destroy us. So like, I am more than happy. To keep being given, like, groups of enemies. But it, it always just will be the moment we get strong enemies like these guys on horses. Then these become a problem. I did it! I did it! I did it! It took me six days, but I didn't lose. I survived, and I blocked off every pathway. Okay, well, apparently this, this, the snow land is not available, but I finally did it. I fully, I fully beat the game. I, I, I consider that, like, a, a huge win. That was... Oh. I'm happy. I don't know about you guys, but I am happy. Uh, this is going to be the quickest, fastest video I've ever made. I'll probably post this on the same day as my the one that I um, recorded as well. I'll post these two videos together. Because I feel like this video is way too short. So, like, yeah. Oh, my gosh. I hope you guys enjoyed today's video of Hex Guardian. If you did, please leave a like on it and subscribe to the channel. It would mean the world to me. It doesn't cost you guys anything. And, yeah. Hope to see you guys in the next one. You guys take care.